Good afternoon, folks. My name is Chris Coley. I'm with Fife RV Center in beautiful Fife, Washington. We're located just off of Port of Tacoma exit and Old 99. And today we're taking a look at our Fleetwood diesel pusher. It's a Pacero 38K. Folks, this is a great coach. I love some of the features. We're going to go over them with you right now. Follow me. Folks, we're back at the 2019 Fleetwood Pacero. Just want to go over a couple of the great features with the benefits on this specific coach, okay? First of all, you've got, like all the Class A's, you've got electric steps. But again, it's great for easy entry into your coach. And folks, look at this patio area. It's got a great automatic awning. You've got LED lights underneath to light up under this awning. And by the way, folks, under the awning, we've got a beautiful entertainment center with a flat screen TV and a sound bar for your listening pleasure. Folks, I want to tell you one thing I love about this coach is the size of this tires. In the RV industry, we all know the bigger the tire, the better the ride. And these are 275s on Alcoa rims, as good as you're going to get. And they are Michelin tires. Also, another thing I'd like to tell you, you've got dual fuel fills, one on each side of the coach. So when you're pulling up at the pumps, you never have to worry about being on the wrong side. You're always on the right side. Folks, let's take a look at a few of the more features that we have available on this coach. Folks, remember about the storage. This, I'm going to show you what really sells these diesel pushers. The fact that they have that raised rail chassis and they have complete pass-through storage. Let me show you what I'm talking about. If you take a look here, this goes through all the way to the other side and it's open on the other side too. I've actually had people actually put kayaks in here because they happen to be kayakers and that's where they were going camping. Also, I want you to notice the dirt devil. That means we have central vac, which makes it a great way to keep your coach nice and clean and looking good for many, many years to come. My favorite pass-through is the next one I'm going to show you. Let me show you what I mean. Take a look at this pasture right here. This actually has a pull-out rack so you can store any heavy items you have on this rack. And when you pull it out, it's easy to access, bring into your coach or utilize whatever that might happen to be. Let me show you what I mean. Just with a small, small tug, it comes right out. One thing that I do when I'm camping with a coach like this, I'll actually put a nice cooler right here. I happen to use a Yeti, and I use it for outside uh, refreshments. Water, bottled water, pops, uh, Gatorade, whatever I happen to might be in the mood for. Again, all it is is just a little shove. You're right back in and locked in and ready to go. Let's take a look at the inside of the coach. I'm back again, folks, and we're just coming in here to our Pacero, the 38K. A couple of real important things as you just walk into this coach is, first of all, take a look at a monitoring system right here. We've got our one-touch auto leveling. We've got all of our awning controls here, all of our slide controls here, and then we've got the controller for our pure sign inverter right here also. And it's all underneath this nice, neat little drawer right here. Let's take a look at our ergonomically designed dashboard. Everything has its place. From our generator start button, to our Jake brake, to all of our controls that we do have in the front, okay? One thing I'll tell you also, this seat is extremely comfortable. Fits me like a glove. And I think it's very important when a driver's sitting in his seat for many hours to be very comfortable. Wouldn't you agree? Let's take a quick look at our drop-down bed. Most people don't even know it's there, but this actually is a drop-down, and it's a big one. It's not just a twin size. Two kids could easily fit up there. Even two smaller adults can fit up there. Okay? We've got an induction cooktop. What does that mean to you? You never have to worry about burning yourself on it. They're really great if you happen to have kids or grandkids around available. Also, take a look at all the space that we do have here. It's just massive space for a kitchen in a Class A coach at this level. I do love also the residential style refrigerator freezer. 
actually has an ice maker. And then just take a quick look at all the food that you can put in here. And that means you're not having to go to the grocery store all the time running to fill up a regular RV refrigerator. You have a residential refrigerator right here, okay? And folks, right here we have what we call a J sofa. When your slides are in, it's a regular sofa. And when your slides are out, it actually turns into a sectional. So you have an additional seating here as well as seating right here for you also, okay? Uh, just so you know our pantry area, we've got actually two nice adjustable shelves in here in our pantry area, so it's nice and neat. We've got a great entertainment center back here, again, with a Bose sound bar, okay? You've actually got a, a working fireplace. It's not just for decoration. It'll actually heat this nice little area right in here, okay? Follow me, folks. I want to show you a, a quick shot right here of our mid-cabin bath. This floor plan is a bath and a half. One of the best-selling floor plans there is in the market, especially in Class A's. And this is our half bath. Also, want to let you know that we do have stackable washer dryer. Folks, it's so much better than having an all-in-one. An all-in-one, you can do maybe one or two pieces of clothing. Here, you can actually do a full load of clothing, okay? One key to whenever you want to know if you've got plumbing for a washer dryer, when you see the louver doors, most cases there's a washer dryer behind there or it's already plumbed for a washer dryer. Follow me into the bedroom, folks. Just want you to know that we've got an adjustable king-size bed. Look at the comforter, duvet, the pillowcases and pillow shams all match this coast impeccably. Very nice, very nice, folks. And again, this is adjustable. I'm gonna demo that for you. Also, we've got our own flat screen right here. You've got a built-in dresser, and you've got his and hers cabinets, which normally turns into hers and hers. Funny how that works. But I'm happy to let my, uh, my better half have most of the closet space. Folks, also, this is our master bathroom in the back. Follow me, let's take a look. Just so you know, not only do we have medicine cabinets behind me, we've got ventilation on top, we've got ventilation, emergency exit right here. You've got a power flush toilet with a foot flush, and you've got an accommodating shower right here. Even I fit in that shower, and I'm about 6'4". Folks, take a look right here. Take a look at all this storage. This is wonderful, especially for me. I, it seems like I get more and more medications from my great doctor every now and then, and here I've got a place to put all of them. But even more than that, look at the storage right here. Full extension on our drawers, all AccuGlide rail systems. More importantly, all plywood drawers. Folks, this is a great coach. It's made by great people at Fleetwood. They've got great, great tradition, and we're happy to have these coaches here at Fife RV Center. Thanks so much for coming in. Thanks for watching this video. Ask for Chris Coley when you come in. I'll be happy to show you or take you for a test drive. Thank you very much. Grab a hold of the good life. Oh, yeah.